Hey, what's up guys? I just wanted to share a very quick way of how I lay out my usual productivity workflow. So right now I'm doing a Mac virtual display on my MacBook Air. And this right here in front of me is my MacBook Air. You can see it's nice and large. And then right below here, I typically just do my notes. You can type whatever you need here. It's very convenient just to look down and type. And then I normally keep my YouTube here. And you can see that, you know, the mouse on the MacBook Air moves over to any window you want, including obviously the MacBook Air. And then over here to my right, I keep my email so I can go in here and just check my email. It's very convenient and it's very comfortable, which is an important thing because honestly, one of the things with these windows is sometimes they're too big and you find yourself just kind of like looking up or looking to the left and it's too massive. So I size them somewhere comfortably for me. And then another thing I do just to have background noise is I just kind of open the Pluto app, which I highly recommend. It's nothing but like old shows, classic movies, things like that. And just having this kind of like background noise, it's kind of cool, you know? Um, and I, you can adjust the volume obviously up there at the top. And you know, what's nice about it is with the spatial audio, like right now it's behind me. So it feels like there's a TV back here behind me. So that's basically it. Short video. Let me know if you like these short kind of tips, real world usage kind of scenario. But again, you know, Safari, Mac virtual display, and this is it, you know, and it's just a very nice, comfortable, efficient way of working. And then this cool new feature, of course, and I'll see y'all later.